Clocks are stopwatches, torches are water. That's right. You're all muted. That's right, we uh, are going to start... This is always so daunting. But then when I'm, whenever I'm like near the finish, I'm like, oh, that turned out great. Like the Wolfie or the, the Enterprise, you know, those F3 builds. But at this point, it's very, I'm very daunted. <laughs> I'm like, what have I gotten myself into building a thing in Minecraft? But we left off many moons ago having pressed F3. Well, speaking of which, I should probably plug in my F3 button. You know, so we, we can press it. Um, but if you've got your woofs ready, that's what I do? Is that what I do? Then I think I'm ready. Whoa, whoa woof and ba! Woof and ba! Okay, that's the first thing we need to do is fix our base of operations. Because <laughs> being on the, the axis of jitteritude is most annoying. Oh, hello. Um, no, I should do this. Oops. I'm already building, not even wasting any time blasting into it. Get blasted, everybody. Well, that's not a good place for a door. Oop. That's not how that... Where's this door? No. No. There we go. Alright. Where did I get a single diamond from? Oh, that's the leftover diamond. There we go. That's... That's more like it. Watch out, sheep. All right, temporary base of operations. Much easier to go in and out of a doorway that way. Um, hi. Remember Minecraft? I guess here can be in, like, my work area. Alright, let's put away stuff we don't need. Um... That's practically dead, I should these sheep and be done with it. So, what I'm gonna need is a lot of sand and or gravel. Of which I see none <laughs> around this lake that we've chosen. Because the plan is to do a reverse like a revert, like a, a, an inverse is probably the better word. An inverse floating point monument, where the floating point monument was a water wall. Here we're going to make a water canyon, a water trough. For those of you who missed it, 9,864,725. Somebody did point out. Except for the number one, we've got every number. And three. No repeating numbers in the whole numbers of the Z. All 
All right, the F3 is saved. Okay, there's some sand over there. Good thing I have a diamond shovel. This isn't a lot of sand. I need I need like a desert's worth of sand. Oh, a wolf. Oh, well, here's a lot of sand. Oh my god, is that a spawner? <laughs> I just dialed the F3 number as a phone number and the president answered. Oh, well, we're about to find out. Uh, no, I don't think it is. I think it's just a... It's a it's a Tomb Raider suck. Suck water. Here goes nothing. Blit. So, how's it going? <laughs> what else? We haven't had... We're, we've been playing Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider isn't really a place to talk and chat. With my good friends on Twitch. What's new? I don't even... I can't remember anything that I've done. <laughs> since since uh, pressing F3. I mean... I don't know. I don't want to... I, I mean, I still... I could go, and I don't want to, on about how, like, even taking time off didn't mean I felt like I got anything done. I've done gardening. I did just, right today, dig out my first garden, or, like, the first... It just is not producing. I did a lot of, like, lettuce and cabbage and stuff, and it's just too hot now. So I'm gonna, like, re redo the soil in there and maybe plant some fall stuff. Lithos was down with COVID. Yeah, that's never gone anywhere, which is surprising, right? Because everybody including the government and the media and everybody has been saying that the pandemic is over. But now we're in like a surge that's like bigger than some of the surges from 2000. Crazy how that happens. And like the Olympics have it, like the actual Olympics. The concept of the Olympics caught COVID. I'm, I don't, yeah, I don't know. When I did go to my doctor's appointment for my blood, the the nurse asked me, or assistant or whoever it was, asked me how many times I had COVID, and I'm like, definitely the once last year, but this last thing me and the girlfriend had was really possibly COVID as well. Although it didn't come up on the test results as such. Yeah, I've, I have kind, I kind of stopped wearing masks at the grocery store, but I'm back to wearing gra masks at the grocery store. One of, like, three people the entire time. The, the, the doctor's office weren't even wearing masks. 
And I went in there with a mask, and they're like, you know, you don't have to wear that here if you don't want to. I'm like, uh, no, I think I will. And it's like a cancer center. I don't have cancer that we know of, but that's just the only place that could do this type of blood test. Ishroom doesn't think they ever got COVID. I mean, you could be part of that, the, the minority who is just naturally immune to it or has zero symptoms of it when you do get it. That's probably still not going to be enough sand. <laughs> I'm just saying. But yeah, then the RN or the nurse or whatever, whoever it was, uh, she's like, oh, I've had it seven times. Aww. Good lord. How would... why? <laughs> Granted, she works in medical, and she said she, like, during COVID, she worked in, like, a hospital ICU, so was, like, surrounded by it constantly. But still, I'd be like, so, you, so you've had, like, over the last four years, you've had COVID more days out of the days you haven't had COVID or something? Getting dark. Yeah, I didn't really ask her what her symptoms were. Like, if it was as debilitating as it was when we got it. Oh, there's guys outside. Oh, there is guy. Oh, this is helpful. Oh, and there's a bunch of gravel up there too that I didn't know. That's a there's a lot of guys. Oh, I'm right by a cave. Um, all right, I'm gonna go out and run. <laughs> Oi! Don't even think about it. Oh no, I gotta murder you. That was a net profit. Oh, whoops. I want the chest. Uh, yeah, I don't know if, uh, Simone has visited and talks about physics girl. Here's the plan. Thinking of a trough from that island all the way to there. They did do a recent like live stream fundraiser for long COVID research. But I think it should be three wide. Well, I suppose if I do it out here, it's going to be five wide. Well, that could be cool. Well, let's, I guess let's do a test. Oh, okay. It's not very deep, which is a bo bo bonus for not doing this in the ocean. It only took nine or ten uh, blocks.
Nine blocks. All right. Okay. This is now feeling a little bit more feasible. Ah! <laughs> okay. Maybe not like that. All right. It's fine. Huh. I guess I'm going to need to build like a s scaffolding. That's the right word for it. Now, the fact that that's flowing is weird to me. But I don't think that that matters. This is dis disorienting, isn't it? None of the blocks are moving. I'm just watching the selection box move. <laughs> we are cutting a lake in half. Yes. Okay. I'd say start three wide, then build to five. That way you can empty out the middle for its sand. True. You might be onto something there. Uh, one thing I have been getting a lot of in the garden is mazooks. Got some good zooks. I got pumpkins. Pumpkins is growing. Like, I didn't realize how much space pumpkins take up. Like, the vines. Oh, uh, we did, I did, yesterday we just had some green beans. I got a bunch of green beans. Uh, what else? Got a lot of tomatoes, but they're not ripening yet. I don't know if it's been hot enough. I can never tell if I'm, like, watering them enough or too little or too much. Oh, I did make uh, blueberry jam. Because we went and picked blueberries. We got four pounds of blue blueberries. <laughs> and I made blueberry jam. I haven't tried it yet, though. I fell in. Not from our garden, but there's a local place you can pick blueberries at. They did explode. I had it, I was doing it in a pot, and it seemed fine. Lo and behold, and as a word of warning, when it starts to rapidly boil as it's supposed to, it tends to, like, double in size. <laughs> Let's just, just imagine whatever amount of jam and fruit you have, it's going to double in size and figure that into the size of the pot you're going to use. But yeah, it was a very panicked, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, and it like went over all over onto the burner and started to burn and I I like ran and grabbed a bowl and put the, the hot thing into the bowl and was like, ah, the thing is still hot, I can't wipe it and it was, uh, it was really frustrating. Because I was very much like, why, why, <laughs> why can't anything just go smoothly <laughs> for me? Just, why? <laughs> I'm just trying to do a thing. It was funny because on Instagram, 
much more famous Minecraft YouTuber, LD Shadow Lady, did like Raspberry Jam, and the same thing happened. So uh, I, I'm glad it's a common beginner experience. This sound effect isn't going to get tiring, is it? Will half the lake be sand? No, not... no. We're just doing a strip. A stripe. Fruit stripe gum. Oops. Oh, wasted. Oops. I got him. Ah! This time. All right, so we can get like a half, a half away per day. I should just make another bed. Or like just elevated hidey hole purposes <laughs> instead of having to run all the way back. Honestly, I should put it at the since I'm going to be around here. I don't really think it... There's plenty of light. That was unnecessary. Okay, that's not Wolfie. <laughs> Is it? No. That's just a wolf. Where is Wolfie? Other than... There he is! Alright. Outside the draw distance. Still gonna need more sand. I did, I did work on the dots and some. I got the front finished. <laughs> now I got the rear end up. And I got, what did I do? I've recently, I disconnected the brake lines. I disconnected the, uh, the rear sway bar, but I don't know how I'm going to get it out. Without also having to disconnect the exhaust, because it goes over the exhaust, annoyingly. I'm hoping I don't need to replace the bushings. Because A, I would have to order them, and B, that's just an additional pain in the ass. I also disconnected the drive shafts. Ooh. I changed the oil on the Subaru, which was overdue. God, I 
That really makes it sound like I wasn't up to anything. <laughs> We went to a uh, wedding reception of one of the girlfriend's old roller derby friends. There were horses. What happened to my boat? Oh, I left it over there. Well, I gotta go over there to get more sand anyway. Horses doing roller derby? <laughs> It was like a, I mean, I don't know these people, but like, she knows the girl from Roller Derby. And like, they had it at this like big f house with a farm, it's like a horse farm. They have, what what kind of horses were they? They were, what are, what are some Arabian, Arabian horses? And uh, like, they had a whole thing out in the garden and tables and band and everything and... At first, I thought it was like at an event place, you know, like this area rents out the place for such events. But the girlfriend asked the father, he's like, no, this is my cousin or brother's or somebody's, somebody's land. And we come out here all the time, like, dang, are we poor? <laughs> who, who, how, all, who, who? Does everybody just own, like, a large tracts of land in the country? With horses and acreage? The old sand mines. <laughs> Us poors get married in strange fields, not fields that we own. It had like a pool. We didn't go swimming, but we did play. We did play ball sacks or uh, uh, sand sacks, sand sand sack throw. Sand bag bag toss. We played some bag toss. Sand Lassac. <laughs> Sandbaggers. Ooh. Oogie. Stop saying sack. <laughs> I can't. Our poor diamond shovel. We really hoped for a better life for it than this. Isn't it like you get one point if you get your sack on the wood? <laughs> and then like two points if you get it in the hole? Is that not the game rules? Cornhole. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of the most I knew about it. Five in the hole? I thought it was like three in the hole, but I'm like, that seems like too much. But we really weren't keeping score. Speed! One on the board, not touching the ground or bouncing. Three in the hole. I don't think it matters. Well, it, I mean, whoever you want, whatever rules you want to follow. But I feel like if it bounces off the ground and onto the board, then it's 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 wherever wherever they rest, which is why like you can take away points by knocking somebody off the board or knocking yourself in the hole if you were on the board. You have friends who have looked up the official association rules. Is it a is the is it a, an Olympic now? Kinda, it is kinda shuffleboard, but with sacks. And a hole.
If it touches the ground, it can't count for points. See, I feel like that requires more skill. <laughs> And it also, like, prevents a bunch of annoying arguments about whether or not your sack touched the ground. Spike ball? <laughs> Is that the one with the, the little trampoline? I call that one dude ball, because it's always dudes. <laughs> or bro ball. Always bro, bro dudes. <laughs> I see people playing it, and it looks like not real. <laughs> it it looks a bit chaotic. Happy spike ball, my dudes. Gals can be dudes. Gals can be sax. <laughs> Dudes of the sack. Right, I don't want to like too much destroy the surrounding landscape. A, that's, that's what a group of gals is called, a sack. Oh, don't break, don't break. It broke. <laughs> You're new here? You're not new here, pessimistic snake. Or is there somebody else who's pessimistic who we have in chat sometimes? I fell in. Oh, you did do an S for sarcasm. I see. What did we decide for the monument at the end? You're looking at it! Oop. A strip of sand. Hello? Alright, so this is the F3 line. We want to go two out. Oh.
Go. What else happened? What else is going on? I definitely, I probably definitely maybe had stuff to talk about, <laughs> but I don't remember now. Will boats fly up the cavern, or will they get sucked down? I don't know. I guess if you're going with enough speed, you might be able to bridge the gap. I mean, it's definitely something we have to try once it's done. Yes, the sand will be removed, and we will remove the water from the bottom of the ocean. I don't think that this is too crazy of a design. It's just regular crazy. <clears throat> yes, the reverse of the last monument. Also, the last monument was going this way. This one's going this way. I guess theoretically it is only going to be three wide because the water is going to float out on the side. Although as Subsponge says, there's a way to make it a hard edge. I do, huh, I do need to dig a trough though. Although, I, actually, that might be how I could make it the hard edge. Is I dig the trough. Under this layer. Layer. Because water always wants to flow to the lower side. That's going to be difficult to do. <laughs> A Moses trough, if you will. <laughs> Yeah, I, I'd have to make the trough first, but I don't know where it needs to be. Unless I, like, dig it underwater. Oh, 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 oh. That's a problem. Couldn't have done that. That's a lot of sand. I mean, I guess I could dig out the middle here. Yeah, not drowning is a thing.
Yeah, basically... If I have this right... It, it's also difficult... ...to dig underwater. And also see underwater. Ooh. Oh! Oh, Ooh. I'm drowning! <laughs> okay, maybe that's a bad idea! <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's bad. That's not the way to do it. I don't know how else to do it other than other than to remove remove the uh the sand and replace it with this top layer with dirt. And then that would give me access to dig from within the trench. Oh. Well, that ain't gonna work. <laughs> I'm stupid. Alright, alright. Let, let me just... I think I need to make it first. And then make it <laughs> like then then you know instead of trying to do a shortcut Oop. Our sands are bust. Yeah, I could I could recover the this middle row, which is not the middle, mind you, but the middle of the sand at least. I'm in a situation where I need sand, which I kind of do. I fell in! Side sleeper? Well, how about you all? Is there anything new with you all? Since we've not had a chance to chat during our tomb raiding. You have a job interview next week. Nothing new here. You finished sewing some plague doctor masks for yourself? <laughs> There's a whole lot of badness happening. You 
really are the most devious bastard in New York City. Hurt clap. Fromps. Thank you for six months in the sub tub. Much appreciated. ZK. Couldn't find the right pet gate for sale, so you spent 16 hours designing and printing one that works with cheap conduit pipes. Interesting. <laughs> I guess... Oh. Oh no! I, I'm trying to preserve the natural uh, bottom of the lake here. I guess what was wrong with all the pet gates? Like a weird size. Because, yeah, we're just using some of those pet gate baby gates to keep Juno from getting on the basement stairs. Dang it. Dang it. Too fast. Ah, it's a, I see. It's a gate to stop baby, but allow cat. All right, I don't want to go too far and then end up flooding myself here. Oh, I had like five blocks to go. Like, ten blocks to go. <laughs> Ah, I see, I see, I see. So it's a cat gate. You can't legally say it's for babies. Can I have your pudding? <laughs> this subscription not suitable for infants or small children. Panda Power! Thank you very much. That was weird. For 68. Oh, nearly. Nearly nice months. In the sub tub. Much appreciated. Sub tub. Anti dog gate. Yeah, Peepers is getting real curious. I mean, we've kind of showed the cats to Juno and vice versa. And Juno has been very good. She'll sniff Peepers and not react. So I don't know. It might, it might be possible in the near future. They're never going to be able to be alone together, but... It might be possible 
to mingle the pets in their old age. <laughs> This stream contains chemicals known to the state of California to cause cancer and birth defects or other reproductive harm. What? I understood that reference. Oh my god, just... there we go. Oh, I'm getting some lag. Oh, maybe it was just because of all the sand on the ground. That's freaky. It's like the walls don't move. <laughs> They're in the walls! You need a ladder. I don't need nothing. I need a bladder. Speaking of ladders, I, we need to come up with a solution to keep tree sap off of our cars. <laughs> that, is, that doesn't include cutting down the 60 foot tall dug fur that's causing all the harm. There's carports. But the way we park doesn't allow for that. They're also super freaking expensive. Like even the like pop-up fabric ones, they're like $300 or something. Maybe not 300, they're like a lot of hundred dollars. Oh. What was that? Did we all see this ghostly apparition that was here? It was a squid. Well, that's what we were thinking was a sun, like a sunshade type tarp situation. Uh, but we would have, like, we could connect it. I'd have to, like, draw you guys a diagram in Photoshop to get a full appreciation for the scenario. Damn, there's so much left. What do we got? Four. We got four, four blocks I got to get rid of. But that was my latest, uh, idea, is we could somehow string between the deck and the fence posts, like two guide wires, 
that would go over where the Subaru parks and then have one of those sunshades attach. That was four, right? I should honestly probably have torches down here. I do have... I mean, it, they would attach via like, via like clips. So like if it is going to be windy or it's going to rain a lot or something like that, we could just unclip it and fold the whole thing up. Um, car covers are annoying. I do have a car cover. It's just a real pain in the ass to like arrange it. <laughs> And then go back and forth and cover the car and then uncover the car when you need to get somewhere. And then you gotta have somewhere to put the car cover and make sure you don't mix up the top and the bottom because if you get sap on the inside of the car cover then you're really just smearing sap all over the car. Done too hot. I, mean, I got one for the pickup truck that just covers the cab for when, uh, before I got the windshield fix and the windshield was leaking. And even that one, it's like, it's too much trouble. <laughs> the problem with the port is that in that spot, Usually we park the Corolla, or the Corolla, the Subaru, but then sometimes if I don't want the truck to be blocking the garage, I park, I drive in and turn right and park the truck. So a carport with like the carport poles would prevent that from happening, which is why I'm thinking something that's completely off the ground and, a, you know, strung up like, like one of those sunshades. This is honestly faster, but I hate that it's going to destroy my shovel. You just fold the cover in half so the inside is only touching the inside. Have you tried that before? <laughs> With a full-size, vehicle-size cover. It might be fine the first time you do it. But if every day, every time you want to take the car out <laughs> to go grocery shopping or whatever. Eventually you get lazy and you just stop using it. Like I did. The thing is, we had the tree trimmed last year, so I think it's fighting back. <laughs> Now when now do that when it's bigger than you. It has little straps around it. And one side is covered in sap and bird poop. Park under a large trampoline. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't know. It's gonna. Ha I think it's gonna have to be a custom jobby. And also, we don't want the house to look like crap. So big blue tarps are out as well. <laughs> Just sell the car. I mean, I want to sell the truck. Volvoitis. It is. It's a disease. A 
Although there is a Saab wagon. I think just like cones on Bring a Trailer right now. It's in California. I wonder how much it's going to go for. It's only at like $1,000 right now. What about big brown tarps? I think it's a 9-3. I'm pretty sure it's a 9-3. I don't know what Cone has. No, no, it's it's the it's not the Sabaru. It's the it's the full size Sab sport combi guy. I would have a Sabaru too. All right, all right. Now I'm starting to see the vision. Now it's starting to be. I was like, this isn't really going to be very big or very impressive, but now I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. Are you not impressed? I'm a Subaru impressed. <laughs> you could have sprinklers constantly spraying an arc over the vehicles. It's so annoying. It's what's really annoying is that I moved the hearse outside like momentarily to like lift the the 280 the Datsun in the in the garage differently and it got sap on the hood. And in in removing it I I gave swirl marks to the hood because the rag I used I guess wasn't great. That really annoys me. The girlfriend doesn't care. She's like, that's fine. That'll buff right out. It probably will, but who wants to buff? Okay, so this is the full width. So what I should do... Get more dirt. That's the other thing, I do have the like tar and sap remover for automobiles. That doesn't work very well. <laughs> I use goof off on the windows, but like on the paint, it's pretty much screwed. Like that was even one of the reasons why when we were trying to sell the girlfriend's car, they were like, well, we got to get it detailed because of all the tree sap and that's another thousand dollars off. Bees! Get off my sugar! Bad bees! Bad! Ow! Ow! Oh, they're defending themselves somehow! Monumental. Monumental. Hmm, I wonder if this is gonna work. Cause isn't it all source blocks all the way down? I mean, I guess I can try on that block right there. After I sleep. Starcot, thank you for 83 months in the sub tub.
I don't know that this is going to work now that I'm considering it. No, it's not. Oh, God. Huh. Well, this is troubles. Stop pushing me away. Well, no, see, I need to make a trench on the outside, not on the inside is the problem. Okay, hold on. I need to get up there. This is a pickle. Yeah, do I do I gotta go wider? But that's still I still need to make a trench somehow, is what we're trying to figure out. Is how to make a trench without drowning. Oh god. Oh god. I'm so sorry, sir. What a disaster. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't test this in creative first. Do you think I've ever tested any of my monument builds in creative first? Or any of my builds, for that matter? <laughs> Remove the outside layers first. Ah, so everybody telling me to start from the inside was wrong. But I guess that still causes the problem of how do I dig a trench from underwater? Do they not start to die when they're out of the water? I don't have creative mode. There is no creative mode. Gosh, hurry up and die so we can mourn you already. I'll save you. Okay, I won't actually. <laughs> huh. Uh but now I don't even know if a trench is going to work because every block is a source block, not just the top layer. So basically the water on top 
is going to think it's on a block, even though it's another water block, and flow over, regardless of what we do. I just need to make sure that once... So we're not going to have a sharp edge. That's out. But once it does that, I need to make sure it stays straight and doesn't flow into the trench. Right. So the question is, is how do I make that trench? <laughs> I tried here and then I drown. Okay, I can do that. God, it is so dark. I can't, I cannot do this. I can't do this. That's impossible to do. If the top of the water is flowing down, the bottom blocks will follow. And how come that doesn't work? All right, here's a test. I got I got two blocks of a trench right right beneath me. Hi. Yeah, no. <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to go with no on that one. Um Bucket the water in. It look it look it looks like it's the opposite. It's like an every other thing again. Cuz that's what ha that's what happened with the the uh the the floating point monument is we ended up with a texture. You'd have to see how I did it. Can you describe it using interpretive dance? Oh, damn you. All right. Okay, so now if I break this... Oh! Okay, but then that does that because the block underneath is a source block. Not adjacent. Who's adjacent? Oh, so I've fucked it up is what you're saying. Need to take out the edge column. And take out every other source block at the top. Like that. Eee! Well, not necessarily a thicker wall, but I'll have to do this on the outside. <laughs> I 
Or wish I could see for more than three seconds. Three milliseconds, that is. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, this is this is this is a non-starter. <laughs> that uh, that I don't like. So I remove these. No, but then that. No, that just doesn't. Well, now I've gone and totally messed up the water here. <laughs> <laughs> um, I have to do that all the way down. Sweet, merciful source blocks. Ah. Oh, balls. <laughs> okay, I kind of fixed it. Oh, God! Oh, Jesus! Oh, my God. I'm screwing up. We're gonna have to load from the backup. <laughs> All is lost. I don't think this guy's gonna die, everybody. <laughs> I think I think he lives there now. Well, that's the problem. The water bucket trick doesn't work. I need to uh Maybe we just empty the whole lake. Okay, I fixed that. Oh, that's the wrong way. Place block. There, okay, I fixed that one. Alright, this I just gotta place a bunch of... Uh. Okay. Place blocks. Place blocks. Oh, oh no! Why didn't you tell me I was drowning? <laughs> uh. I don't know how I did that, but I certainly screwed things up more by doing it. Okay, I may be fixed, but the layer underneath is probably fricked. Well, that's fine. We'll never. We'll, well, that won't bite us in the ass in the end. I don't mind the flowing water. What I'm trying to do is figure out how to dig a trench. I mean, I guess what I can do instead is build a platform, like build a floor. Up. Golden apple time! Uh, where's all my- oh, there's my bread. Oh, I left my door open. Just make the final wall out of glass? That? True, I could. We do have a lot of sand. Um... For the bottom, do we just need little gutters? Right, I need little gutters on the outside, <laughs> is, is, is the problem. I guess I just make it super wide, huh? 
Which is what everybody's been telling me to begin with. Maybe, maybe I make the floor out of glass. I'm going to replace these now. Since we've given up on that idea. Oh, drown for me. Where am I? I don't know. that go? I think so. Oh god! Oh god! Damn it! <laughs> it happened so fast! Did I not have a full set of bubbles for like three seconds? Well, I guess this build is about to be super impressive. We're going to be able to see it from space. Is that guy still alive? He sure is. I've sparked an evolutionary branch. Hello. He's the foreman. Where's the afterman? Ah! Uh... That's Mo that's Moses. <laughs> it's Moses the squid. Friends call him Mosey. Nope. Alright, where are we at? Alright, I can dig this this outside out. Needs more sand. <laughs> oh, nuts. Now I need the... Do I have my diamond? I don't have my diamond. Can you put the squid in the minecart about... No, animals... Creatures and the like do not inhabit vehicles in this version. Nor can you obtain cop... Nor are there cobwebs. I don't think there is cobwebs. He'll eventually despawn, I assume, if we unload this chunk.
tried pleading with the water. Like he's going nowhere. <laughs> well, but if I dig a trench here. Then the pathway will only be one wide, and that's not what I want. Dang it. Right, I mean that was that was the plan. That was my next plan, was to raise the floor so that it just creates a natural trench on the outside. But I'm still making a, an extra width to, so that that effect actually does something. Oh, could use slabs. Damn, I need I need torches for this to work. I see the nighttime. The nighttime I see. Oh, that was dirt. Gotta preserve. <laughs> it looks like the squid is moving, doesn't it? Why does it feel like I'm losing sand? <laughs> I mean, other than the sand that still is here. I feel like I should have more sand than this. Uh, if you're thinking this is still going to go too fast, don't worry, we still have the other half of the lake to do.
Okay. Now we need to do the same thing on this side again. True. You, you, all you gotta do is get a windstorm on the Red Sea at low tides and pocket sand, Moses sand. Dang it. All right, I need more sand. interesting. I mean, well, that's interesting that this dirt is going to get covered in grass. That'll be a nice contrast. The green and the blue. Art degree. Oh man, we I I don't know. Did I ever mention getting rid of all of my art <laughs> from art school? Cuz the girlfriend is doing this drawing class and she's got to like draw fabric and I did a fabric drawing that I thought was pretty good and I was going to show her. But I can't find it. <laughs> I can't find any of my art. Ah, here's some sand. Probably not enough. No. Ow! Oh, stop breaking, you idiots. Oh. Yeah, this should be enough. It won't be. Some of the, most of those aren't my art, though. It might also be where the Guinness World Records certificate is as well, if I can find it. I just can't see myself. I, at the same time, I can't see myself. I can also see myself being like, I don't need these anymore, recycling bin.
I found like some stuff that was mostly like my graphic design work. It was less interesting. But I thought I had it in my, I have one of those big, you know, when you're an art student, you have one of those big portfolio case things. I thought they were all in there, but they aren't. <laughs> No matter how much I get, I'm like, I thought I should have more than this. Alright, let's see. Oh, that's right, I broke my stupid boat. Oh, is Squid still going to be here? Because we left the area. Is Moe's... Mosey. Oh, Mosey left. He moseyed along. <laughs> ah. Good. Good, good, good. Oop.
Good lord. This is a momentous day. You and I have just taken the first step towards ensuring peace between our peoples. No Leaf Clover, thank you for the raid. Welcome, Radios. Okay, so. I'm trying to think what I do <laughs> here. Do. Huh. ENT. I mean, that would be interesting if I could find enough TNT. <laughs> Just like blast. My way through. <laughs> Just make a crazy crater, crater, crater based F3 monument. Remove one column from the outside wall and see what happens. Well, no, what I need to do is lift up the ground. I'm just trying to decide what I want to do. Like, do I want to do glass? Do I want to make a bunch of smooth stone slabs? We could test this in creative. Get out of here! Never. That would be cheating, and that would nullify my F3... My F3, my far lands run. Uh. Lake. Um. I mean, I did say that I I did like that the grass was spreading. And I can preserve that look by putting glass. But also it's going to take forever for the rest of that grass to spread the rest of the way. True, that was another reason. But I still, I need the sand too, which is kind of annoying. I need the sand to do the other half. <laughs> um, just sand. Problem. This is going to be a problem. Let's fix that right away. Um, I 
You want it to look like it looks now with no sand and just water flowing down. Ye I mean, that would be the ideal. That would also save me a lot of time <laughs> with, with making a new floor. Um, yeah, I think that method, subsponge, I appreciate it, is going to be very frustrating. Just based on what frustrations we already had. <laughs> in our mild attempt. I mean, I guess what I can do, I guess if we don't want to preserve, perfectly preserve. I guess I can make this more of a sensical staircase. Doesn't have to be perfect. There. That was pretty easy <laughs> to just make it do its thing. All right, and I'm thinking. I think it's slabs, which means I need a lot of cobblestone to then smelt into smooth stone. And that way I don't have to have a bunch of torches and things won't spawn on it. Although, will things spawn on glass? I don't know if they will, honestly. Glass is spawn proof. Huh. Damn. <laughs> now you've made me back to square one of making a decision about it. Um, true. Yeah, I guess it would just save me from having to mine a bunch of cobble. My 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 slight problem with it is that it won't make a smooth staircase. Mother, you've been spreading rumors. Why? You hear any good ones lately? Monument building and a jeep shirt. And a jeep shirt on me. Timo Warner. Thank you very much for fifty-seven months. In the sub tub, much appreciated sub tub. Use wood slabs. Ah, I don't think they look good. I mean, let's be honest, glass in this version of the game looks pretty atrocious as well. Uh, let's see. I guess I could do a test. Test glass. Although conveniently, I turned all of my uh, coal into torches, so that's cool. <laughs> um, okay, I gotta find a bunch of coal or make coal. Oh, excuse me. How you doing, Wolfie? Doing all right? Bored? <laughs> me?
Me too. <laughs> oh, shoot. Ooh, skeleton residue. Anybody got any coal? There's some sort of free coal. Seventy-eight percent of the way to the Farlands. <laughs> Nothing. Oh. Oh, there's a whole cave right, literally right here. Yes, but do they have coal? Oh no, Wolfie! Oh shit. I don't think Wolfie came. <laughs> Lazy dog. <laughs> All right, this is a silly idea. Although he's probably going to be angry. There's a year left before what? <laughs> a year left before what? Oh, that looks cool. Oh, he doesn't care that I got shot. Yeah, that tree grew. One year left of walking. I'm eating all my bread. All right, I'm going to let that cook. Uh, I need to use the restroom, so I will BRB. AFK. Woo!
All right, I'm back. Uh, actually, um, I I just remembered I need to feed the cats. It's it's like an hour late for their dinner. <laughs> um, I guess I guess let's look at what this looks like. And if it's terrible, we put it in the trash. Okay, where's this torch? Oh, actually the girlfriend just got home. Oh. <laughs> Hello. How are you? She brings me a gummed worm. Are they gluten free, though? Mm. Heck yeah, brother. Heck yeah, brother. I've got a, a worm. That's been gummied. Uh oh, she's she's turning on the mic. I want to. It's, she's got stories. I got crinkles. Most worms are gluten free. Sur surprisingly, not the the what are they called? Bimbo. Uh, Harboro. <laughs> Harboro. No, but in real life, I think worms, as long as they're not eating. Oh, meat real farms. real worm. I got two of the same color. What a jip. Oh, what a rip off. Oh my god, I think they're all the same color. Oh, they're all red. What? <laughs> they ran out of the other flavors. No, they're just like to get the gluten free ones you you lose color. To get the gluten free ones you they're, lose... they're just not as colorful as the uh... Oh yeah, they're all the same ones on the front. Well there's like a Yeah, there's like a Ooh. white. Warm. Well, you know. <laughs> Listen pre, pre warmed worms. Listen. I'm bearing gifts. This is the They pays me in fair I receive. They pays me in worms. <laughs> you should pronounce it like that. Worms. Like it. Mm -hmm. Well, I have gifts for you. What? Another one? Another gift. I did get the. F oh. Oh. Stickers. These are awesome. These go from that thing today? Mm hmm Very cool. Did you bring some of yours? I did. I gave the person I bought those from a I don't know about that one. No, I mean, that one's just from the... You know what it looks like? Did you show it? Oh, it does. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> hey, Internet, what does this look like? <laughs> Certainly nothing you've ever seen on the Internet before. Internet. Women do be eating gummy worms. <laughs> That's for sure. It, uh, you know what? All genders be eating with gummy worms. That's true. And that's a story. That's a fact. Um, do we? Do you want a statistic? I've not. I'm not. I'm basing this on um, no my, science. My research. Mm. My research. Uh, only ten percent of all children on this earth are tolerable. The other ninety percent are stupid. <laughs> They're stupid. You hear I, that? And I, children I don't know I have some other opinions but there were multiple children today that I thought I'm like you know what would fix this snatch them up by their little oshkosh bagosh <laughs> and tossing them in, in the bog toss them in the bog I don't know I, I was like wow you, you guys are really tolerating behavior I sure wouldn't like it was very uh yeah. Yeah. Oh, does grass still spread under glass? Sorry, I didn't mean to. Oh, you did. 10% uh, seems high because I'm basing it. Uh, my uh, sample size was very small. So there was one behaved one for the 10 other, for the nine other ones that were there. So there's, there's a, what is that called? A, uh, it's a T test. An air, uh, 
the error the oh margin of error margin of error yes i'm i'm is wide yes so we have to assume that the rest of the population yeah really annoying Mm. I and like one person had three of them. I'm like, what the hell did you do? <laughs> Why? What did, Why you, did you do? Why did you do that? <laughs> yeah, I, I, sciency, but I was just like, wow, that is somebody who probably really enjoys infants, and thought, oh, that was cool. Do it again, and then they just got bigger. <laughs> and do now it again, and now you're stuck with them. Yeah, because they were clearly all done right in a row, and they were probably infants, fairly. At, you know what I'm saying consecutively <laughs> they were infants at least one to three years after they that's were born that's what I'm saying but they, they were all seven, nine, ten ish I don't know and uh, complete little crackheads I don't know I really really <laughs> wanted to uh, I really want to uppercut one of them I'm like kind of giving them the, the evil eye like when the parents weren't looking just mm. like you know, they at least reacted to that a little bit, like simmered down, but still. I was like, I just looked, I was like, ah, oh, that person likes infants. They weren't betting on the fact that they would survive mm. into a, an older age. I mean, we could go back. The, the Oregon Trail would have took out a few of them. I'm just saying, some dysentery, some... TB's going around. I'm just saying. Fun facts. I, I'm there just you go. sorry I don't have anything positive to say. <laughs> hey, you know what, though? Built a lot of bat boxes. You built a lot of boxes for bats. Yes. They got their little maternity wards, is what we were basically building. Mm. They weren't really hibernating these, but little bachelor pads. Mm. Bat. Bat. Chiller, Chiller pads. I I was in a crowd where I didn't even try to make a joke. No jokes. Someone was like, that one has a bat painted on the front. I was like, yeah, so did yours. Like, flip it over. Oh. I'm like, really gonna come into a place, <laughs> build these janky bat boxes, and cry about something that is there? Shut up. Get but up. the gummy worms are good. Yeah, sorry. Here we go, everybody. We. Oh yeah, I guess this one is a lighter gum, gummed worm. Yeah, they are all red. Oh, here we go. Five flavors: cherry, orange, or apple with green. I don't see any green. Did you have any green already? No. I see no green. The apple worms are extinct. If I touch them all. Flavors from real sources. Color from real sources. <laughs> As opposed to holographic sources. I did not feed the cats yet. I was about to get I know, they, they let me know. Don't worry. Okay. This was pretty much peepers. <laughs> Fight me. <laughs> Worm, worm streaming. From real worms. I mean, all of this probably touched worms at some point. There's apple juice in it. Apples, it was like apples. Apples is worms. So what do we think of the glass? It's a little... bold. <laughs> bold. It will have water flowing down the sides. Yeah, I gotta go. Mm hmm. You hear? Can they hear the sadness? Oh, maybe. Thank you. Um. I'm one 
Victor. I'm trying to think of how this is going to work. So let me get more glass. Replace the glass with lava. I could put lava underneath the glass. So, let's do a test here. Oh, dang it. I hate when that happens. I guess... Well, I need to make, like, a railing. Like, have another block of glass up here. I have double height. You know what I'm saying? Or will removing this... work? Isn't that where you need the trench? Well, no, now there is no there is no need for a trench because I've raised the floor up one. So now the entire lake is the trench. Yeah, I basically have to dig that block out first. Or 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 well, Or I could have done it smarter <laughs> and not place the glass and instead use dirt. Boy, I wish I knew where this was. Oh, it's over here. Jesus. Okay. Oh, I bungled it. Oh, I bungled it good. No, 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 no. Wait, what? No. Oh, nothing happened. That was the wrong block entirely. Okay. <laughs> this is difficult. <laughs> okay, I think I need to break those. What if I do it like this? It's not gonna... or is it? Yeah, it will. Huh. Yeah, I guess... Oh, that's dumb. The door trick? Well, yeah, basically... I... <sighs> I need to break the bottom blocks first, <laughs> which is difficult on account of that they're underwater. <laughs> Tunnel under the water from the shore. From the shore? No, we've already tried that. I will drown. I cannot work underwater. It's impossible.
replace the second to last sand with dirt. But then it's going to flow over the dirt. I would have just done the underwater work and have been done with it right now. Incorrect. False. Lies. Impossible. I'm... Hmm. <laughs> it's a fabrication. Pure fiction. Yeah. Without dying. Basically. I need to remove that block, put a torch under it, and then simultaneously put a block here and up. <laughs> Water will still spill. I guess... Alright, I'm just gonna try something and we can undo it if it is bad. <laughs> For us. Okay, that's... kinda bad. But, what if now... Is that that block? It is. Ah, oh, beans! Oh, oh, cause the... Stupid water got rid of the torch. Nope. Okay, so now, let's just hypothetically ruin everything. Oh, you fudge. <laughs> no, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Ooh. Ow. Okay. Uh, now, now, see, we can dig from the bottom up, and everything will be fine. I'm so good at video games! We just have to do that the entire length. <laughs> okay. Alright. Okay. <laughs> Um, that, that, that sure is a method. <sighs> yeah, it would be easier remove the outside wall first but actually harder because again I'd have to be underwater to do that I wonder if I can well actually what I should do is I suppose now that I have it this way, it should go smoother, right? Oops. Yeah. Yeah, that's the first one's the most difficult. No. We need all the blocks because this is all source. If if only the top was a source block, we would only need the top block. But because they're all source blocks,
All right, and it is kind of sharp. Okay, it's not at all sharp, but that's fine. <laughs> I can, yeah, all right, this works. Why does the glass floor help? Because in Minecraft, water always flows. down a block so back when the the floor was the same level as the floor of the lake there was no down block so it went everywhere but keeping it on the side keeps it from spilling out this way Yeah, the crappy thing is, is I need to replace that bottom block with glass. Otherwise, I would take the outside right now and then remove this, but I need to, I, I need to replace that bottom block. I could have avoided this by making the floor all sand, <laughs> but here we are. Oh, this is going to take ages. <laughs> and I was thinking like, oh, and then we could also do like two spawn chunks to pay homage to the spawn chunks on like either side. But no, I don't think that's good. That's now that's scope creep and that's not going to be included in my original quote. So what am I doing? I'm breaking this. Magical. Get rid of that. Make it sand. I hope that doesn't cause problems. Ha. Okay. okay. You can just keep the sand there instead of adding dirt. No, because I need... I need to replace the bottom block with glass. Oh, would I be able to? Would that work, do you think? Well, I guess let's find out and see how wrong you all are. <laughs> Oh, don't do that. Oh, jeez, I'm ruining everything. Well, I need to extend the glass. Like, now I need to replace this with glass. Will that get ruined if I don't do it fast enough? Ah. Okay, I guess I don't need to do that part with the dirt. Um. Okay, so that... Simplifies. How am I going to do the steps? I mean... That should be fine, unless the upper block wants to flow down. That ain't gonna work anymore.
Right, I'm gonna have to do the weird trick to start the other side, but once I've got a seam... Oh, don't I? Do I have more glass? annoying. Why is it like that? <laughs> Did I do that? Was that my fault? Yeah, that's bad. Oh, because I made these stairs, but I didn't do the same thing on the outside. Shit. Digging the sand from the top. But then I gotta run all the way up to the top every time. And now I'm drowning. Alright, yeah, that's bad. I'm not gonna do that. Alright, this is... I have a problem. Oh, or is it? Well, it's going to be. Okay. Um, minutes and. Oh, it doesn't even... Wait, what? <laughs> I guess... Well... Huh. Because... Huh? <laughs> that, that This, I think, is a special... case. <laughs> that wouldn't work everywhere. Look at my boat from underneath! Oh, this looks crazy. All right, now this is what I'm kind of worried about. Unnecessarily worried about, I suppose. I don't need to dig no dirt block. No dirt block to dig. Could this have been a way to have done this without needing the glass? <laughs> Right? Are are we thinking the same thing here? Oh, you need a hole within seven blocks. Oh, I see. That's weird. Alright. I, I didn't think so, but... No, not, not hard edge. Angled edge. But hard bottom. <laughs> which is a preference some people have. Yeah, 
Hands on a hard bottom. This is screwy. I gotta get rid of this block first. I think this one's screwy. Right? Yeah, let me get rid of that. This one is screwy. Okay. Give me my sand. I needs it. I do actually, I wonder... Oh yeah, that's not a problem. Not a problem. Not a problem! Not a problem. There we go. I've restored the seabed, the seafloor by the seashore down to its original content. May, that it may contain. All right, we are one fourth of one half of the way there. <laughs> Woo! And I definitely need more, much, much, much more coal and sand to make this glass floor. Yeah. I wonder if it'll if I could do it easier starting on this edge. Right?
Interesting. Most interesting indeed. <laughs> oh, Lord. I don't know what I'm going to do to symbolize the F3 point when we get there. Oh. Hey. I mean, that's fine. Blue, blue wool to symbolize water. If you dig down one more, I guess, I guess, yeah, I guess this might have been a way to dig down outside. I kind of like this. Also, I don't want to change it up again. <laughs> Smidge suggested it over an hour ago. Jeez. sand noises. I'm getting sucked in. Ow! Oh! Ow! Oh! <laughs> Stupid glass. Oh, this is this is my original trench attempt. Trench tempt, as the kids call it. Pretty slow going, just like walking to the far lands. Symbolism. Oh. 
about the journey and not the speed at which you trench. Oh. There was no sand. No sand! Uh, don't drown. <laughs> like the flying boat. Oh. Who pushed? Oh, I push. I push myself, it seems. Can, I can dig it. I should pick up this sand before it despawns. So don't drown. Don't drown. Uh, ow! I can live with the glass. Well, that's gonna look weird. Eventually, it will look weird. sand goes flying absolutely blasting out there <laughs> you know where I meant to place that block all right I guess I do need to do some like caving or something for coal That's going to look cool from the outside. Where's the light coming from? I mean, other than the sun, I guess. <laughs> I guess the sun is illuminating the ground? Because there's no torches there. It's coming from within you. I mean, there's torches over there, but not here. Huh. Yeah, I guess... I guess water... makes darkness. So then where there is not water, there is not darkness. 
so true. What do you think I'm doing? I gotta get I gotta get a good speed going here. I gotta get my cheat speed. He dies. Ooh. <laughs> That's fun. Ah. <laughs> uh. That's good stuff right there. <laughs> and that is when he jumped the trench. <laughs> I mean, if anything, all of this, all of this strife has led to a, a wider trench, incidentally. Incidentally. <laughs> like at the world through a filter or through a wall of water perhaps wider is better <laughs> Is Wolfie moving? I guess Wolfie might be getting pushed around by the sheep and other such bananaries. Build him a little dog house. Well, I usually have him like inside the main house. When I'm doing this. So I really just gotta expand the house around him. That's what we're saying. Spruce this place up. Knock down a few walls. Get new kitchen cabinets. Look at the discerningly close pool of lava underneath. Oh, oh. oh I guess I was outside the block. There we go. Swanky. Alright, so what am I doing? I need coal. Yes, I could chop down a bunch of trees. But what's the fun in that? Um, I fell in the water. was a cave system nearby that wasn't full of skeletons that shoot me like that other one.
Doesn't mean I'll go exploring it again. Waiters. Boss, waiter. Oh no. Ah, multiple spoilers. Ah, multiple spoilers. <laughs> this is a terrible idea. Who whose idea was this? Oh jeez. Oh they they come. A spoiler spawner. Or something. Alright, there's coal. The hell's that? Oh, that's one of my arrows. Oh, sure are a lot of spiders. Oh, there's a spider down there. Wait, did I see flames? Is that a spawner? I don't think it is. Listen, don't talk to me about all the coal I'm using and tor the the tor the torches aren't coal anymore. As far as we're concerned, they never were coal. It doesn't appear as though there's any impressive veins of coal. Listen, it's fine. Ooh. I'm just gonna use a couple. Well, this is a place. Place that I'm not going. And that, my friends, is the extent of caving in Far Lands or Bust. Yeah, there's just too much around here because I've been hanging out. Normally, there isn't stuff. I got 14 out of that. <laughs> I sure you could wish. I sure could you. I sure wish you could. Listen. <laughs> I, never mind. I take that back. Oh, there's some coal. me as a kid. I was originally a meme kid. I'm glad I'm here. See? 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 Peeks!
Good stream. It is almost good stream. I just really need to fill. Ah. Why didn't we do that? Remember the boats? We should have just filled this lake with boats that you could just walk over. <laughs> now that would be an F3 monument. And it'll also probably crash the game. <laughs> remember? Remember the boats? Remember boats? Why not both? They would all, like, bounce into each other and then conglomerate in the trench, destroying our hard work. Alright, since the sun is setting, I'm gonna take that as a sign. A symbol. An homage. An oracle. A soothsayer. An oracular. An or- oh, is that what it is? Oracular? I was thinking, like, that was some sort of, like, op optometrist tool or something. <laughs> I don't- I don't know what. I don't- I don't- like an eye, like the thing that blows the air in your eyeball that everybody gets a kick out of when they go see the eye doctor. I'm the eyeball kid. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep in our luxury double wide hidey hole here. How many? I don't even remember what we started. I didn't even make note of it. But now we're at 69,760.61 megabytes. For anybody keeping track. <laughs>